with A over there, hey? Dirty old Dutch Shorter Bolt Bills over here, eh? Freaking right, it did. Good old Princess Auto voice. Gross peoples. So all I did was set the motor into a couple little doodads and whatnots, but I haven't uh, put the bolts in yet and this and that and the other thing. So if you want to see this thing run tonight, don't forget to subscribe and like, eh? And hit that notification bell bar button. Why wouldn't you? But let's see if we can't get the right bolts and hopefully these will work, boys. I bought nuts too, just in case, boys. These are still too short or too long or whatever the hell they are. Because I don't freaking know. But they're up in here, they are. And if this cart was upside down, it'd probably be a hell of a lot easier. Freaking right it would be. But hey, it is what it is, it is. Can you see me? Probably not. Why would you? How the hell would you? Not on my knees, boys. I'm on my side, eh? I'm laying down on the job, I am. Freaking right I am. So, they're quite a bit shorter, so I should be good to go. But now, they're probably too short, boys, because by the time you had a washer and the doodad, I don't know, boys. It's going to be hard to tell it is. Let's get one in there and see how it feels, eh? Why wouldn't we? Oh, boys. Oh, boys. It feels pretty freaking good, it does. Oh, she's mint, boys. Hey, we got her. That's what we needed right there. So I'll zing these out, the long ones, because they're not tight, they're just finger tight, boys. Then we'll put the short ones in, and we'll tighten her up, and then we'll bother her uncle. Bob's our friggin' uncle, and get to her, and hopefully get it running. I doubt it. I mean, friggin' doubt it. Why would it ever run, eh? Oh, careful! Oh, well, this my back sore today. That's why I wanted to lay down. I wanted to lay down and look at you, I did. Oh, they're going in nice, they are. Ah. Oh, yeah. Decent. All right, so pull this one out. I did this so the motor was lined up when I got home tonight. I didn't have to fool around lining it up because it's not easy lining this motor up. Freak, no, it's not. And I'm missing a lock. No. I was going to put Loctite on these, but no need, boys, because I'm using the lock washers, eh? That'll lock her in real good. It will. Oh. Hey. Oh. Oh, hey. Get in there, you son of a beaver. One more, boys. Terrible. What the hell's going on here? Oh, there it is. Ah, <sighs> hey. Ah. Uh, I gotta find the lock washer. I'll be right back. Wait here for me. Why wouldn't you? Found her, boys. Freaking right, I found her. There it is, boys. So let's get the right size doodad and we'll snug these babies up. Remember, don't over tighten them, eh? Because you'll strip them out again. Then we'll be screwed, boys. She's a 19, she is, hey? Half inch bolts. 19, boys. Nothing like a good 19, eh? Friggin' right. Kind of a rude thing to say. Oh, boys, that feels good. I need an extension for freight seats. Why wouldn't I need an extension? <laughs> it's probably too damn long. Oh, she'd be good. Decent. Oh, yeah. Now we're cooking with butter. Oh, yeah. Oh, freak. It worked. Freaking right it worked. Hey, boys. Get up here, would you? Oh, the motor. It's a greasy old son of a beaver it is, hey? Got the old lube tour I did. See if we can't get you somewhere with a good angle. A good angle. Decent. Can you see it, boys? Freaking right you can see it. Bring it up a little bit. There we go. So, we'll put the belts on, we will. So, let's start with the old starter belt. We'll get that on there. So, we'll slot that around the pulley here. And hopefully I can just walk her on, boys. Walk her on, boys. Watch your fingers, boys. Oh, boys. There she is. Decent. And then we'll slap this one on, we will. Open up the clutch ruski. Slap her on the back. And give her another walk jump. Walk her on, boys. Oh, yeah. Friggin' right. That was friggin' easy. Oh, careful. So now that we have that done and move the camera again, we gotta put my cup back on. I painted the old cup a ruski to match a van of ruski. What the hell wouldn't I? So we'll get it back on. Oh, boys. Oh, compression stroke. Hey, right? it doesn't look the greatest, but hey, it's gonna get dirty anyways it is. Not a very good paint job there. Did this last night when it was dark and I was frustrated, so what do you expect? Paint never turns out good when you're frustrated, boys. But she looks mint, she does. One, that side looks better. There we go, boys, cover's on. The old clutch cover, boys. I think we might have to change the bearing in that too one day, but we won't worry about that right now. Man, I can't remember what I need to do. I don't even know how this thing hooks up, boys. I'm just guessing. So, what I did last night, also, 
was a doodad and thingamabobber was missing for the old chokey, so I had to make one of them. So I made a chokey cover thingy, which worked perfect. I mounted the old throttle linkage just loosely. Hey, loosely, boys. Let's move this over. I got no damn room over here. How would I have room over here? Holy. We want to push this thing too far. Now I'm running over sockets and everything else. Get out of the fucking way. Holy. Is that thing like that to push around all the time or what? Must just be because it's a new bell, boys. <laughs> what I need to do is start hooking up the old wiring. Because I'm not sure on the wiring on this thing either. So we'll go orange to orange, boys. And this is just going to be a rough hookup just to see if she even bumps, eh? And then we'll go these plug in somewhere too. Where the hell'd that go? Where the hell's the wire for it, boys? Oh, it's on the wrong side. That's got to come over here, it does. <laughs> Why is it over there? <sighs> there we go. So then we got... Oh, fuck. Got all sorts of different colors here. We got orange and red, green, stripe, the other one. Make the other one, boys. So we got to get this hooked up, which rods are missing, but I'm going to make it out of a coat hanger I am. But that just opens the old exhaust valve, it does. I'm thinking, you know, so when she shuts down, she closes. So if that shuts down, it'll close like that. Friggin' hope. I hope that's not closed. Huh. I'm going to have to figure out what's open, what's closed on that. So we got to tighten down that spark plugage because it's just kind of loosely in there. And then I want to turn the engine over to make sure spark plug has clearage. Decent. So now we'll turn the motor over and make sure nothing's hitting something. Good. So now I'm just going to turn it over to make sure everything turns over, boys. Oh man, I'm getting excited. Oh yeah. Sounds good. So now let's go get some fuel and put some fuel in there and see if we can actually get it running. Get it running, boys. Well, we did empty this fuel tank so we can start with some fresh fuel in it. So we're just gonna set it here for now. Cause like I said, I wanna make sure it's gonna run. I wanna make sure it's gonna do anything, to be honest with you. We should check and see if the fuel pump's pumping. Pretty sure that's for the oil pump. Yep, she's sucking, boys. Friggin' right, it's sucking. So let's get some fuel. All right, boys. So this is my chainsaw fuel. It's 50 to one. So what I'm gonna do, and it's not quite empty, so I'm gonna add another full two stroke because I want this thing to run rich for the break-in I do. So we'll add a full jug of that. We'll make her smoke like a son of a bitch, we will. Gonna break her in right, boys. And then we'll fill her back up, top her up, boys. And that will give me probably about a 75 or a. Eh? Maybe you can give her a hundred to one. She's gonna be rich, I'll tell you that right now. There we go, boys. So now we'll give her a little stir. There we go. And we'll dump her in, boys. We'll give her a little choke action and see if we can't get some smoke coming out of her. Hey, okay? see if we can't get a fire up, boys. Like I said, I have a black wire here that I'm not sure where it goes and stuff like that. So I don't even know what's gonna start, boys, to be honest with you. I wish the curve would quit moving. Okay, let's check for spark. It's first thing we need to do. And this ground needs to probably be hooked up too. And this ground needs to be probably hooked up. I wish this thing would quit rolling on me, boys. I'm gonna jack her up. Get some in the bowl. Oh, we got a hole in the line. Thank God we checked that. I gotta check stuff, boys. I need a new line is what I need. Actually, that line is just deckered. Here's a piece, boys. So we'll cut this one off. I'll put a new line on her. There we go. Pull that off. Put that in here like this. Decent. And we need her about that long right there, boys. And there, let's try her again, eh? I was wondering, have you seen my dad? No. So did you get the right size bolts for it? Yeah, yeah, I just uh, trying to get it fired up right now, but like I said, I don't know if this wire goes to that or this. I know it's supposed to go to one of them. Is it on spark? She no go. Yeah. All I know is you gotta watch that gas pedal because you get a shock off of it. <laughs> I'll figure it out. Yeah, that's for damn sure. Hit that gas pedal for me, bud. Whoa, what's the gap on that plug? That plug's not getting spark. Can't see! Jim? No spark. She won't run without a spark. It's the only problem when you try to put back in something that you didn't take apart. There's only a couple of lines that are. Missing though, so I should be able to figure this out pretty quick. All right, boys? Girl, be able. Yeah. There we go. We got spark. It could be timing, it could be anything. Like I said, it's. Let me the ding ding ding. But. I'm gonna keep playing with it until I get it going. 
Well, boys and girls and peoples, I took the carburetor off because um, I think it might be carburetor issues, boys. So I took the carburetor off and hopefully we can get her fired up now. Please start, eh? All this hard work. Please start, for freak's sakes. So we'll give her some choke and we'll give her some key, boys. Right, we did, hey? Freaking decent, boys. So there you go, she's running. Freaking right, she is. So hopefully, you like this video and give it a big thumbs up there if you think it's pretty decent. It's running now, boys. Now we can actually start on the fun stuff. Freaking right, we can, even though it's all fun. But uh, might take you along for a little ride here, maybe, maybe not. But uh, if I don't, hopefully, everybody's having a good day like me, hey? And not doing anything I didn't do. And uh, you know what to do for now. 